Aaron True, MMA Prime TV here with former Invicta FC 105 pound Adam Weight champion Jessica Penne. Jessica, up until your last fight, you were 10 and 1 and had never been finished in your career. Known as somewhat of a submission ace and grappling ace yourself, what have you done since the submission loss to Michelle Watterson? Have you taken a look at yourself and what you can change, or what have you done to improve as a fighter? Um, of course, anytime you compete, uh, win or lose, you have to look at yourself and see what you did right and wrong. Um, I honestly, I shouldn't have taken the fight. I should have backed out. Um, but my my pride and competitiveness got the best of me. Um, I was not as sharp as I should have been going into that fight for reasons. Um, so I've just been training my butt off and excited to get back in there. Your work ethic is second to none. I see you training at multiple gyms, you hold down a job. I mean, you're literally busy from sun up to sundown every day. Talk about how your work ethic has contributed to your success. Um, it has everything to do with my success. I, I surround myself with uh, like-minded people and they push me and um, make me want to get better every single day. So I just, I, I enjoy what I do and I love the people involved and I just couldn't do anything else. Your road back to the Invicta FC Adam Weight title starts coming up at Invicta FC 6 against Nick Dolly Rivera. She has an 8 and 6 record, but is that record a little bit deceptive and is she better than her record seems? Absolutely. I mean, um, a lot of a lot of women's MMA records don't really stand true to, to what they really are. Um, she's fought at a higher weight class and found her home at 105 just like I did. So. Um, that record really doesn't mean much. She has um, an impressive amount of work in her fights, and I'm looking forward to it. This will be your fifth fight at Adam Weight, 105 pounds, your fourth fight in Invicta at 105. How good does it feel to finally be consistent and to stay at 105 and fight people your own size? It's, it's great. Um, I've always felt like I had a size disadvantage competing at 115 because you know, that's the weight that a lot of us walk at. So it's, it's exciting. It's an exciting time to be part of women's MMA, and it's an exciting time for Invicta. And um, really, when I went down to 105 pounds, there really was only one or two other people competing at that weight class in the States. So I'm glad that Invicta has really picked up the weight class and showcased us the way we deserve to be. In terms of your focus for this fight, how focused are you? How determined are you? And what goes through your mind when you think about your opponent, Nick Dolly Rivera? I am extremely focused. I'm excited to get back in there. I just want to keep improving and and I just I love to fight and I'm glad that I get the opportunity to fight for an organization like Invicta. Tell everyone why should they watch Invicta FC6? Why should they watch your fight on July 13th? You know, there's no other organization like Invicta around um, showcasing the best of the best in women's MMA, so you'd be a fool to miss it. <laughs> This is Aaron True, MMA Prime TV, here with Jessica Penne. Jessica, we look forward to watching you on the road back to regaining your 105-pound Adam Weight Championship. Best of luck in the future. Thank you very much.